so we we have Shalan on here, and uh, we thought we'd just grab Shalan for a sec. She is a busy mom at hockey mm-hmm. trials, but um, she's going to tell us just real quick because you're hosting a session at CHFA East. Yeah, right? I am. Uh, um, so I think this actually, I uh, I think this is probably my sixth or seventh time doing a brand education session. Okay. They've changed the names a few times, but I am doing a talk um, and I'm focusing on kind of the background of Herbaland um, and kind of our disruptive nature because uh, I did speak at CHFA West and we talked more about, you know, the products that we were launching in our rebrand, but Herbaland's kind of up to a few things. We're really focused on sustainability. So I'm doing a brand education about how we are, you know, kind of changing the way we do business and in the sense of our packaging, our switch from plastic to compostable, Mm -hmm. all of our sustainable initiatives that we're doing and how, you know, the retailers, we've really opened up an opportunity for the retailers to be a part of this. So some of the things we're doing is we partnered with a tree planting organization. So we plant a tree with every pouch that we sell, but we're actually offering uh, an opportunity for retailers to be a part of this with us. Um, And then we're even handing out some really cool tree planting goodie bags, all sorts of fun things at the show. So we're really excited. So this whole brand education is about why we decided as a, a, a gummy manufacturer and and a gummy brand why we wanted to take this lead um and why we wanted to kind of disrupt the industry a little bit with the the big changes that we've done i love it i that's I pretty think, cool uh you know we, we've had a bunch of guests on the podcast that have started to move to compostable packaging blown uh-huh. away by some of it but i'm thrilled by it because you just you know, as a consumer, you, every day goes by and you, you we all know the, the planet's in a lot of trouble. And we we put it there and, um, you know, you, you need to buy stuff, but can you buy better? You want to buy stuff, right? Buy so, so now at least you can buy and, and contribute to at least not making the planet worse. Um, yeah, yeah. So thrilled to hear about that. Um, yeah. And then and then thrilled to hear more about, you know, kind of the history of the gummy and, and uh what you guys are doing with it now. So that should be a really interesting session. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Um, they're always, I'm not a boring speaker. Most people know that, but <laughs> so yeah, uh, it'll be good. But yeah, it's pretty neat to see the innovation as I'm laughing away at myself here. But um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. And um, like I said, Toronto is one of my favorite shows. So it'll be great to be back there and, and speaking at the CHFA. Is there anybody else in, in your space, like sort of in the gummy nutritional supplements, et cetera, that's doing anything like this? Or are you really, truly disruptive, disruptive, like, like you guys are? Yeah. We are really, the eh? first vitamin gummy brand to go compostable. Oh, shit. That's pretty cool. Wow. Yeah. Wow. So um, I know even in North America, um, I mean, there are brands that are doing compostable packaging, but in our space, um, like we are the leaders in the gummy manufacturing space. We're the number one gummy manufacturer here in Canada. Um, 80% of our business is gummy manufacturing and then Herbaland itself, like our brand is the other portion of that. So we do lead this space. So we are the only one as of right now that is doing compostable packaging and, um, And by the end of 2023, our entire line will be compostable. So we still have a few products that are in bottles that we're just waiting to get into packaging. Um, But by the end of 2023, everything that we put out will be 100% uh, made with uh, compostable packaging. Well, then I'm going to talk to you when we uh, get closer to getting the store open. We're not going to carry much Haba. We're not going to carry much Haba at all. But I definitely want to carry a few small vitamins and things like that. Nothing crazy. But Mm -hmm. I'd like to do that because local and doing Mm -hmm. cool shit. Local and doing cool your, shit. Yes. Your session is September 16th. So that's the Friday. That's the Friday. What time? So hopefully 415. Watching this, it's their time, not our time. Uh, yeah. yeah. Eastern Standard Time. Don't come. Eastern Standard time. time. Yeah. Okay. We don't want all the West guys <laughs> yeah, so showing up so, by so just so after by lunch then, so. and thinking, hey, what happened? Because <laughs> you know what the Western guys There's will do when we of- leave. <laughs> There's a lot of amazing speakers, I have to <laughs> say, for Toronto this year. Like, I'm actually going to attend a couple sessions myself. So. But uh, yeah, four fifteen right before launch pad. So awesome! Mm-hmm. We got a few yeah. of you on. Like I think we got Lorna yeah. next week. Yeah, hopefully awesome. we'll and we'll hopefully we'll put that out right away because there's a few yeah. key people that we'd love to push people to because I think it'll be just interesting. Yeah, and people should get to yeah. know you because you're just fun. I just like you so. <laughs> I'm not boring. No, you're definitely not, not boring. boring. No. <laughs> no, definitely not boring. Um, thanks yeah, for I, jumping on, Shalane. Yeah, good, it's nice to see you guys. Dog. I'll see you guys at the show in a couple of weeks. 
Yeah, and then you'll you'll tell good us. Good luck on trials. You're uh, you're gonna you. send a celebratory note over when she. Yeah. Makes it. You'll either see the sad emoji with Which the wine glass, or the freaking party like celebration emoji Woo-hoo. with the champagne. Awesome. How about that? Awesome. We love it. <laughs> Have fun. All right. Okay. Go. Bye, you guys. Thanks, Ciao. Lynn. Yeah. Well, that'd be kind of cool, Phil. That'll be it. That'll be it. Yeah. That'll be fun. She's always got some cool stuff to say, but yes. I do like this. Uh, that's interesting. That's not. Um, uh, yeah, I don't know any. That's why I was asking her. I mean, I know it's disruptive, but I, like, that disruptive. That's pretty cool. Yeah. 